Hey guys, this is Carla. You either know me as the owner of the Plum Bottom Shoe Store, or maybe you know me from my yoga classes. Um, I've been teaching at Om My Yoga for almost seven years on the Carlisle Pike in Camp Hill. And um, in either situation, one of my greatest passions is really sharing health and wellness with others. And I thought it was the perfect time to try to merge those things together and start a little series about healthy feet. And one of the ways that I take care of my own feet personally, and it is with um, doTERRA's Deep Blue Rub. And we're going to look at some techniques that you can use with the Deep Blue Rub, and we're going to talk just a little bit about what makes the doTERRA Deep Blue Rub so special. This is something that you would use on all of your aches and pains, whether any kind of muscle or joint stiffness and soreness. Um, there are 28 bones in each of your feet and over 100 muscles, ligaments, and tendons in each of your feet. Your feet are so hardworking. They carry you everywhere all day long. And even when you're wearing the most comfortable shoes, your feet can get tired, achy, and sore after a long day. And they need a little bit of our help. Add to that maybe some issues that you're dealing with like bunions or plantar fasciitis or neuroma, and the Deep Blue Rub is gonna be incredibly helpful for any of those situations. Um, it's made out of wintergreen oil, camphor oil, um, eucalyptus, peppermint, blue chamomile, blue tansy, osmanthus. Um, those are all the essential oils. You can actually get Deep Blue as a essential oil just on its own, totally unadulterated. Uh, I, I really love it as the rub because it's great emollient and it allows it um, to be absorbed more readily into your feet, but it's not at all greasy. It totally absorbs in. So um, this is something that you can use to give yourself an amazing foot massage. And I happen to carry little packets in my purse that if I, I always opt for the most comfortable shoes I can wear, but sometimes there's a special occasion that comes up and you have to be in a shoe a little bit longer than you'd like to be. So even in the best case scenario, your feet might hurt sometimes. I keep those packets in my purse and as soon as I can, I rub the deep blue on my feet and my feet never get tired, achy or sore like the next day. So it's, it's a wonderful thing to always have on hand, especially if you're traveling um, and it's the, the reason that the deep blue rub works and the essential oils themselves are so effective is that it creates like increased circulation to the areas of the body that the oil is rubbed on. Um, and it has a very cooling effect. The increased circulation is going to be excellent because that means there's greater blood flow to the area. And that greater blood flow means that there is more oxygen available and the oxygen is going to be what helps the healing process along. So it's, it's just excellent for any kind of foot condition that you might have. Um, I'm going to show you a special technique that I use when I want to give my feet a little recharge. Um, and again, great for anyone who has bunions, plantar fasciitis, uh, neuroma, really anything you can think of. So I'm going to put about a dime sized amount of essential oil on my hands. And first of all, you can rub your hands together and just just inhale because first of all, it has the great aromatherapeutic properties, but we're going to give our foot a nice massage here. You're going to rub it all the way from the ankle all the way to the top and the sole of your foot. And then you're going to try to bring your fingers in between each of your toes. This is particularly good, a uh, good thing to do if you have a bunion or a little bunion um, that in training. <laughs> so try to slip your fingers in between your toes or the best you can, and then work your foot in each direction. Give yourself maybe like 10, 12 circles in one direction and then the other. So you're going to do this for longer than I'm doing it now, but we're going to work our way through. And then you're going to take your first two toes and then the other three toes, and you're going to put the heels of your hands right there on the ball of your foot, and you're going to work your foot in either direction. Right, starting to release the metatarsals of the foot. So it's like you're scissoring your toes. And again, you're going to do this longer than I'm doing it now. And then you're going to work your hands in a ringing motion from your ankle all the way down the length of your foot towards your toes and then back up again. And again, you could do this about 10 times, working from your ankles to your toes and back. And then you're going to take your foot holding around your ankle and you're going to shake as hard as you can and just completely release those metatarsals and then sit back and just feel the fabulous effects. Um, I like to just close my eyes and then notice the difference between the left and the right 
And you can actually feel like that space that you've created in between those ligaments and joints. And you can feel the tension being relieved. Like I can, I can literally feel the difference right now between my left foot, which I've massaged and my right foot, which I haven't. So, um, this was a little massage technique that we used the deep blue rub. And I'm going to put a link on this to actually a resource where you can buy the deep blue rub or the deep blue oil directly. You could also reach out to the store where you can find me. Again, my name is Carla. And um, hopefully, if you haven't explored the use of essential oils for your health, I've got to tell you, it's absolutely my favorite way to stay healthy, not just regarding my feet, but in all aspects of my life. So you can look forward to some other videos that are going to feature some different essential oils, as well as other tips and techniques to keep your feet healthy. I want to thank you guys for watching today, and definitely consider sharing with a friend.